Christiana. How are you doing? I hope you're doing well. Um, let's see. It is Saturday. Again, a Saturday. Well, not again. My last ones were, my last videos were done on a Friday. <laughs> I know, I have no brain. But anyway, it is Saturday, October the 14th. And I came outside to try and do a few things. I don't feel good. Um, feel like I got a head cold or something. My boyfriend has, has been um, not feeling well for the last few days and sounding like he's got a head cold. And now I'm starting to feel kind of yuck. But anyway, I took some vitamin C, an emergency packet as it's called. Um, then I came outside and wondered why the light looked funny. And then I remembered, oh, there's an eclipse. Mm, I mean, the older I get, I'm like, really? <laughs> anyway, this video is going to be out of order. This is actually going to be a video recorded today and trying to upload it later today. I was just going to do a little update <clears throat> um, on my seedlings, on some of them, because some have been transplanted. Uh, here's another mess in my yard, which one day will get cleaned up. But anyway, I had, when I planted all these little seeds in these little cups, and I made a video, somebody had said they looked forward to seeing how things did in these cups. So I thought I'd record that video today and show you. Now, some things I have already transplanted, which will be in other videos. And here is Sebastian again. Hi, Sebastian. <laughs> um, so, we'll start with the flowers. Now, my flower seeds didn't do very well. The only thing that came up was, is called Love in a Mist. And that's the only one that came up. What you want, baby? Hmm. His poor little ears. I have to put medicine on them. He scratches because of fleas, which I try to deal with fleas naturally. And, of course, it doesn't work as well as the medicine. But the last time I used medication on my animals, one of my cats went into liver failure. And I won't use it again. So, we do natural stuff and try to deal with it. But, anyway... <clears throat> that's the only flower that came up I do believe yep I think so. no no there is one more where is it I'm lying to you uh, showy milkweed came up so anyway but those flower seeds they didn't do well uh, many of them are from seed swaps and sometimes the seeds you get in a seed swap just don't work so this one is it's a cauliflower and hopefully it survives but it looked like it was trying to break at the bottom of the stem so I buried that stem a little bit deeper today and watered it and it still hasn't withered away so maybe it'll be all right one spinach one spinach this whole thing had a bunch of spinach seeds in it and one came up um it's all it's more the seeds possibly me but more the seeds than anything um this one onion seeds my onion seeds none of my <coughs> regular the head onion the onions that make a little that make a head none of those came up so i've ordered some more seeds which i have i'm gonna try and plant them today the leeks came up i have a beet right here that came up it's hard to see but it's right there i had another one but it didn't do well but this had several bead beet seeds in it and only one has come up there's a tomato right here the tomatoes did pr did uh, well in these little things even in the littlest cup this one had like I think three others that I transplanted but this one was so small still so I just I took those three out transplanted them added more dirt to this um, to let it get bigger 
this is mullein, which is a medicinal herb or plant. And this is peppermint, which there's only two in there. That's like the second or third time, I think, me trying to get peppermint to come up. And then are, there are my, um, let's see, there's broccoli over there. There's cabbages over there. More Brussels sprouts. Uh, what else? Cabbage. I forget what this one is. Let me see. It's written on there somewhere. So, Oh, that's the culantro. Uh, broccoli. Cabbages. What is this? More cabbage. I gotta plant more um, cauliflower. Ugh. Sorry, y'all. I got dizzy. Um, more cauliflower because that's the only one I think I have. This one over here. So Everything's doing good at, when they come up. But that could be me or the seeds. So, I just have to, you know, I'm trying to get things transplanted before they get too big in these little little cups. But they work. You don't have to buy a big old <clears throat> costly containers to plant your seedlings. These little things came like 40 in a pack for a dollar or so at Dollar General. And then, of course, these are reused containers. So, you just have to stay on top of trying to get them transplanted. Okay, y'all. That is the little update on how the seeds do in these little containers. It works. It might be a little bit more... I don't know if tedious is the word. You just gotta, gotta try and stay on top of it. Which is hard, because obviously... I'm not doing real great because some of these are pretty tall. But they'll be all right. They'll be all right. <coughs> okay, y'all. I am going to try and get some stuff done today. Some more transplanting. Mm. i got to figure out where I'm going to put them, though, because some of my pots. I've got several pots out there that still have peppers that are still producing. So, I don't know. We will see. I may just have to up pot. Or I may just leave them we'll see all right hey bastion you want to say hello hey bastion there's bastion he's such a good boy all right y'all y'all have a good one like subscribe share bye now